Hey, James Jones pops the ball backwards, dinked forwards by Tozer. Wrexham and all wise as Palmer knocks it on nicely just beyond Mullen, though. And it'll be dealt with and driven long by Hare. Bothered by that. It's fed down the line. Lee pulls it into the hole. Mullen is there, takes on his man, finds Palmer, a turn pass just oh. overhead. Unlucky that. Well read by Sagaf, who then slices a horrible clearance for the throw in in Tozer territory. At the start of that, though, Sagaf, who, like I said, is not very much an attacking player, filling in at right back, did really well to tackle Mendy. You, <clears throat> when a player is playing out of position like that, you've got to try and target them, haven't you, Mark? Yeah, absolutely. Throw taken quickly, and it's worked down the right hand side. Chance for a cross now. It's Lee on the right side. Sweeps it in nicely. Palmer! Yes! yes! Come get on, yes! We deserve Come that. On. Six yeah. minutes in, and Wrexham get off to the perfect start. We've been on the front foot for, since the beginning. Spent a minute camped in the attacking third. Lovely cross by Lee. Brilliant. Lovely hot volley on the edge of the six-yard box inside the near post by Palmer. And Wrexham take a deserved lead. Oh, I'm over the moon for Palmer as well. Mm. He deserved a goal recently. You know, he, he's had his critics and so nice to see him mm. get a goal. And six minutes in, Wrexham have looked excellent so far. Absolutely, really strong start. Lee, perfect cross. And Palmer, what a lovely side yes. for volley. Just fed it inside the near post. Keeper had no chance. Classic example of the uh, volley, isn't it? You don't have to smash it. That's o is that O'Connell yeah, crossing it? It is O'Connell. It's O'Connell. Wow. I've got to be honest, I've had a little bit of a problem with O'Connell. He seems to have grown a lot of hair since he got injured. <laughs> yeah. I swear. But a poor touch on the halfway line. He's won it back from Jones. Jones still scrapping away, so is Cannon. And Balanta has a very calm play in midfield. He's made space for himself now. Goes backwards. Hair across to Sagaf on the halfway. Like I say, he's a striker, really, you know, or a winger. He's not had the chance to get forwards yet. As Hare stands it down the flank. F. Young's done well. He's got goal side of Tunnicliffe. Tight angle. Pulls it back nicely and it's wow. chipped wide by Bird. He should have done better there. That's F. Young did well. Yeah, F. Young's a very physical mm. player, isn't he? He's a real threat. One of the top players in the league at the moment. Yeah, yeah. Um, to be honest, his um, striking partner should have probably scored there, in all fairness. Yeah. Apologies to um, Tunnicliffe. It was Toza that he got goal side of. Cannon again, Lee is inside, pops it instead to Mullen, who works it back to Lee, 35 yards out, squares it. Jones on the right as Barnett outside and finds him early. Barnett running at an isolated Western, hits the goal line, sweeps a good cross to the far post, good header, clear that by Hare. Jones wins a loose ball edge, and he hits a shot! It's in! Yeah. No, it's oh. not! Oh my word, what a let off that is! <laughs> Wow, that was very strange. Jones hits a shot, it took a deflection, the keeper went the wrong way, <laughs> hit the inside of the post, landed on the line, and just does to Lee on the left-hand side. Mendy's inside him, Lee runs at Sagaf and then tries a cute ball inside, he finds Mullen, Mullen works it around the corner. Long-range shot from Cannon, not bad, Ooh. goes wide, but it was a decent hit by him. And you say about Wrexham getting back on top, well, that's exactly the case, isn't it? Two near misses now. Cannon just blasted that too far wide slightly, didn't he? Cannon blasting. Well, Che got the dagger one in, yeah. so... To me, it looked like he Either tried to it knock out. it off West and, and then right, it, Bar yeah. Barnett dragged it back out. Like yeah, you that's say. What I thought, yeah. exactly what I thought, but... So Dagnum didn't really complain. <laughs> Corner, right-hand side. James Jones taking this. Right, away swinger. No Luke Young, no Tom O'Connor, no Jordan Davis, of course. Short options on. Jones delivers a header! Yeah! <laughs> Yes! yes! Come on! That is a lovely delivery. And there yes. was Jordan Tunnicliffe with a lovely angled header across the keeper, in off the far post. That is good. Who needs all these Luke Young, Tom O'Connor, Jordan Davis corner takers? That's a beauty <laughs> from James Jones. And Tunnicliffe nailed it. Just before half time as well. Mm. I think Dak and we're really growing into this game and. It's nice just get that second goal for the excellent performance we've had in the first half. Good header, that by Tunnicliffe, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, great technique. And the moment it came off his head, you're thinking, that ah, is a goal, there's no one on the far post. Yeah. It's clearly going just inside, just leaning. He's got ha hair pulling his shirt, but he leans That's forwards, gets there first, and lovely glancing head. Toza with the ball in his hands, Lee's offering <laughs> short. Toza slings it into the near post, headed flicked on by the defender, Palmer oh! heads over from about three yards out, a glorious chance. He kicks the ball against the advertiser Gordings in anger. To be fair, I think it came quite high, but still, what a chance. Flicked on inadvertently by oh, Weston, and oh my word, oh, Dagnum. Restart. Ball fed back by Balanta, who's been pleasingly peripheral so far. Headed forwards. 
head tennis this as Bird backs into Tony Cliff. Lee nicks it from him. Cute little nudge to Palmer on the halfway line, driving forwards. Lee has made a good run to his left. Palmer has got Mullen ahead of him. He's still going, Palmer. Good strength and determination. Helps it on wide now. Jones helps it out to Barnett, who again will run at Western. He's been delivering well in these sort of situations, getting to the goal line again. A few step overs. He tempts him in, then he's going to come back again. And uh, Barnett, having drawn two men to him, feeds it backwards. He's been enjoying themselves here already. Cannon helps it wide. Barnett, first time cross, stood up under the bar, oh! headed partly away. Mendy keeps it alive. Ah, oh, and then Mullen well. slices it over the bar. <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy. He's so nice, and yet on the football pitch, he's gloriously dirty. Lee clips the free kick. Lovely ball to the edge of the area. Mullen oh. hooks it over his shoulders to the left hand side. Palmer is there. Mendy's in support. Mendy. Sweeps in a first-time cross at height to the far post. It's kept alive, nodded down to Cannon, edge of the D. Awkward touch for him, though. Back to James Jones, and Wrexham keep it going. Jones works it wide, and Barnett wants to have another run at Western, does he? Well, he pings a good ball in instead, and it's a chance, Palmer! Yes! yes! Oh, I tell you what, Wrexham are on fire here. Palmer's got another lovely driven cross by Barnett from deep, and Palmer held off his man, span, smashed it in. And this is the stuff, isn't it? Yeah, this is a brilliant performance mm. by Wrexham. Another goal by Palmer. <laughs> he's, he's having a brilliant game today. Yeah, yeah, absolutely fantastic. And you can't underestimate the uh, psychological side to this, you know. Yeah. Notts County losing to Dagenham and then us to, to go 3-0 up before... Uh, 50th minute is always good. Another good cross by Barnett. He's drilled it in, and it was a good, good finish. I was trying to find, I can't remember who said it, I was about to read it out, and somebody was saying about, you know, he's making a point, Palmer, you know? Yeah. Don't leave me on the bench again. And it's great that you got Dolby using cracking form, and now yeah. Palmer's too quick to get to the cough button then. So, corner, short option given. But swung it instead, Ooh. headed away to the edge of the area. Oh, James Jones won it, and he's helped it inside. And Tony Cliff's juggling it. His layoff to Palmer's not great, and Palmer on the stretch at least makes a challenge. But it's clear to Effiong, who digs out a clearance of the halfway line, and it's a good pass, actually. Sagaf looks to play the through ball for Balanta. Was he offside? Yes, he was. Oh, well. Oh, I've got myself down in that case. <laughs> oh. Now, kicked it. Ooh, Lainton's taking the kick quickly, trying to be cute. That's oh, a cracking pass to Barnett, who hooks the ball over his man's head and then nods it inside to Jones, edge of the Go area. On. Can he hit it? Left oh, footed, too weak. Too straight the to the keeper. But it was a well, an exciting passage of play, end to end. Even let him win it in the air, defend the second ball. There's no one supporting him, and so it goes straight through to Lainton. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, just, just to go back to that quickly as well, yeah. in fairness, I think uh, playing... Uh, this style of attacking football is actually keeping Dagenham at bay. I think if we would start sitting back, it would probably invite them into the game. So going for goals in this game mm. suits it, but not necessarily. You wouldn't be pushing in every game to yeah. go and score, would you? I agree. That's a good ball forwards by Tozer and Barnett's come narrow now. Driving to the edge area, feeds it onto Palmer. Slightly behind him, he passes it to Lee. Back to Palmer, return oh. pass. Crucial interception by Norise. Or Lee would have been in on goal. Carl Cannon with the outside. He plays that outside the foot pass again. And it works. He finds Mendy. Palmer now. Go on, back heels of Palmer. Chance for the hat trick. Beats his man. Draw. Oh. What a save. What a save that was. He should oh. have scored, perhaps, Palmer. He did brilliantly. It was a great move. A little one two with Mullen. One on one with the keeper. Oh, he's put they, it too close to the keeper, didn't he? They've worked really well to get there. Oh, mind you, it looks like it's too. Uh, the thing with tripe, I would argue, is it, it's sort of it hasn't got that much flavour. It takes like a sauce's flavour. Well, I'd say it's Tony Cliff's done well. He wins O'Connell rather steps in and wins it. Now Lee takes over, feeds a great oh. first time ball. Mendy in on the keeper. Can he finish? It's going wide, but he clips yes! it. And Wrexham have a four yes! lead. Yes. You don't go to Dagenham and stick four goals past them unless you're a bit tasty, I oh, would yeah. argue. Yeah. Um, oh. No tripe there whatsoever. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, well said. <laughs> what a lovely breakaway, though. O'Connell did really well to win it. Fed Lee, and Lee, that first time pass is perfect. Mendy driving in between defenders into the left channel. Got very close to goal into the six yard box, pretty much which made the angle tighter, but he was totally calm. It drew the keeper and he just poked it across him into the bottom right corner. Lovely goal. Wow, 4-0 up and there's still quite oh. a bit to play. Just this be, oh. is just exquisite stuff from Rex. <laughs> it's against, brilliant. Against it? such a decent yeah. side as well. I'm going to be honest, I felt a little bit nervous before today's yeah, game. Same, so just felt a little concerned. He carried it right to the corner of the, of the six-yard box. Dagenham fans leaving the ground now. There's nothing more to see for them. For Saturday's game. 
Well, not forwards and cleared by Wrexham and here's Palmer again holding her up Huxter over the top door beyond the chase oh he's won it as well he's running at the defenders challenge from on the reset could have been a foul leaves them brilliantly finds Palmer he hit this will he right side the box right footed hit the oh! post and it's oh! away from under the bar wow we great work by Dolby and Lee and, and well hit the inside of the post it was Jones beg your pardon yeah. was it? <laughs> Hit the inside of the oh. post, bounced back out, nearly hit the keeper. Hey, Jones is not great. He just assumed that uh, <laughs> Barnett was going to be there, and he wasn't. <laughs> so, here come Dagnum again into the last 10 seconds, surely, though, as Robinson picks her up between the lines and feeds it through, and here's a great chance for a goal for Dagenham. Oh. Overhead, though, and Lainton saves. It'd be horrible first touch. Lainton saves at his feet. And that is the final whistle. Wrexham <laughs> win 4 0 at Dagenham. And to be frank, Dagenham's best moment came in the 92nd minute. That's what you call a comprehensive victory, isn't it? Wrexham, absolutely terrific. Andy, who often co commentates with us, he's the loveliest man on earth, but he's pleasingly violent. And one of the, my favourite Andy Parkinson stories <laughs> is that he once got sent off as player manager of his works team. Um, for going over the ball while a player was preparing to take a free kick. <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy. He's so nice, and yet on a football pitch, he's gloriously dirty.